Hey guys, One Piece Nation here today with my review of the My Hero Academia Episode 2, Season 2. So now, you already saw the episode, so I'm just going to quickly give my thoughts on it. These aren't going to be in-depth reviews like my One Piece reviews or my Boruto reviews because there is nothing to theorize. There's a manga. I've read it. I pretty much have an idea of how this ends, though the manga is pretty fuzzy that I've been read it, but whatever. Okay, on to the episode. And by the way, I hope you enjoyed the reaction. Um, that one posted like an hour ago. So, okay. So it made this episode great. Well, first of all, the pacing. Once again, it was a little dragged. Like, there were definitely things in here that weren't in the manga. But nothing that felt like filler. The one thing Madhouse did, it go, I think they're trying to do is, they're trying to like make, make it so they end at the end of the fourth festival arc, I think. I could be wrong. But the, the, the padding was done very well. So it was really, really good. There were a lot of references to things that were happening. Like, I don't remember seeing a shot like of when Endeavor took out the- I don't remember the robot, but the robots in the manga, I don't think they were. Tell me, correct me if I'm wrong in the comments. But I also don't remember a shot of, uh, Tor Torodoki thinking at his father, or Tor- Yeah, Torodoki, that's his name, right? Torodoki? Yeah. But I remember a shot about him thinking at his dad. I liked the, the training montage. The animation was great. The Endeavor mask was genius. Join me all my in Endeavor math. Like, there's, 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 nobody's gonna make that connection. I, I'm not gonna say it. I'm, normal, I'm only going to really not say major spoilers. So if you're afraid of any type of spoiler, don't watch my reviews. But yeah, these are more for people that have read the manga. They want to know somebody like mine's opinion on the anime. So yeah, that looked really good. Animation, music, of course. 10 out of 10. And the only thing I didn't like was how Deku was constantly thinking about how All Might said he needs to be like, I am here! And he was pretty much like, never saying it. It was kind of stupid. It's like, All Might told you to say it! Say it, you, you, you idiot! But uh, no, but uh, the last thing I want to talk about is, because I brought up quite a bit in my reaction, which is, people have always compared My Hero Academia to Naruto. Not a Monday into a Black Clover. Like, that. I have not read enough of Black Clover. I've read, like, the first chapter. Now, nothing to do with Black Clover. I hear it's amazing. I hear it getting an anime, and I like to always start with an anime. But I may catch up. It's already at, like, 100 chapters, but I may try to catch up to that. But the point is, is that the difference between this and Naruto, is that in Naruto, you look at the tuning of that. Naruto's equivalent to the fourth festival, in case you haven't read, and it's a thing called the tuning exam, where all the characters take a test to see if they should attain the next ninja, ninja rank, which is tuning. They're all getting at the moment. And in Naruto, you can't even take the tuning exam and let your teammates sign up as well. Now, what is great about this is Toradoki said, we are, we are not friends. We are enemies. I will crush all of you. That I love that about my hero. There are a lot of popular shonen are over oh, all this friendship bullshit and this friendship, friends, friends. I will protect my friend, the bond guy. Like, Robin, like, saying you want to live. It's like, it's a great content. It is. I love Bleach for that. I love One Piece for that. I love Naruto for that. I like each one of those theories more than I like my hero for. For the friendship crap. You know, I like it. It's cool. In its own really cheesy, shonen, corny way. It's fun and I like it. I like that kind of stuff. But it is nice to see a shonen with a shonen trope like the cow, like the underdog. Like climbing to the top. The like bit, dreaming big and trying to reach for your dream. But with the spin of it being different. And it's like, it's not this friendship bullshit. It's like, no, I'm going to crush all of you and be number one. 
and I like that. It's also really nice. Deku strategizes. Like, even Ichigo. Ichigo smarter than most shonen protagonists. Like, even if you don't like police, you gotta admit he's smarter than most of them. Like, he, like, he knows basic math. Like, he knows how to add. He's smarter than Goku, Luffy, and Naruto. Well, that's, that's debatable, be smarter than Hokage and Naruto, but that's a whole other video. But, uh, the point is, is that... Okay, Deku's a really, he uses his brain. He, he doesn't really have a style of fighting. He doesn't have a way to fight yet, so we have to use his noggin and think to solve problems. So yeah, I really like that. Hope you guys enjoyed this mini review. I'm not even going to rate these episodes. I'm just going to give you my general thoughts on them. I'm not really qualified to properly criticize these, but I really just want to do videos giving my opinions on them. So yeah, hope you enjoyed this. Tune in next week for my live reaction and review of my hero, which, by the way, how it works is, when my, my, when my live reaction goes up, expect the review an hour later. Okay, everything will be pre-made, so you'll, you'll get them all on time, I promise. Hope you guys enjoyed some of your thoughts on episode 2 of season 2 of My Hero Academia in the comment section down below. Well, guys, have a great day, and look forward to Monday's Attack on Titan video. Yeah! But that's the thing we're going to do. My Hero and Attack on Titan every Monday. My Hero on Sunday, Attack on Titan on Tuesday. We're going to try to wrap these up pretty quickly. And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. All, like video, all that nonsense. Subscribe for more of this. Also, Boruto and One Piece. Peace out, guys.